Hi, welcome back. I'm Dr. Minette Riordan, CEO and founder of the Path to Profit Academy, along with my awesome husband, Brad Dobson. And I promised in this video that I would share with you how to get three ideal clients in the next 30 days. So why ideal clients? If you can't answer that, make sure you go back and watch the last video where I talked about how important it is to have ideal clients, to know exactly who they are so that you're not wasting time, energy, and money trying to market to everybody, but you're getting really clear and specific about where you can spend your time to get the right people that you love to work with and that you can have the biggest impact and create the most transformation in their lives is one of the things that Brad and I love the most about the work we do is we get to play with people who really are just like us. They're creative entrepreneurs who do have a message to share. They have a vision for making a difference in the world and they wanna have a lot of fun doing it and make a lot of money. So we're really clear about who we love to play with. Are you? I hope so, because in this video, I'm gonna share a bunch of strategies for how you can get three of those people into your coaching, speaking, training, author, or design business in the next 30 days. Are you ready? So strategy number one is the most simple. It's be intentional. What does that mean, Minette, to be intentional? It means to believe that it's possible. When I first started making $10,000 a month, my mantra every single day was, I get one new client a day. I get one new client today. I get one new client today. I would wake up in the morning and say, I'm gonna get one new client today. And it worked. It became an actual joke where on a Sunday afternoon, my husband said to me, Minette, you didn't get a new client today. And I said, well, the day's not over yet. And so that client could be a book sell on Amazon of one of my two best-selling books, The Artful Marketer and a Time Management System for Creative Entrepreneurs. It could have been somebody buying our online time management course. It could have even have been someone just signing up for our email list. They all count as people that are moving closer towards doing business with us. But in this video, I wanna share some strategies for getting some of those higher end paying clients. We all love the ones that pay. If that's not in your ideal client profile, make sure you add that in there. We especially like the ones who pay on time. So be intentional and you can use your planner for that. It could be one of your affirmations. I easily and effortlessly attract my ideal clients. That could be the same affirmation you use every day for the 30 days that you're filling out the Artful Profit Planner. The second strategy that I wanna talk about is to just ask, just ask. It's one of the hardest things that we have to learn how to do as creative women entrepreneurs is to learn how to ask. And in this case, to be specific with the asking, to ask for referrals. You can ask for referrals from your existing clients, from past clients. You can also ask for referrals from what I call strategic partners, really looking for people who are targeting the same ideal clients you are, but maybe they offer a completely different service. I'll give you a really specific example. I don't do graphic design, but my clients need graphic design. And graphic designers don't do marketing strategy. They love it when clients show up to them knowing who their ideal clients are and what their messaging is. So we're amazing strategic partners that can cross refer people. So reach out to who you know and say, hey, I've got a couple of spots open in my practice, in my business, in my service, whatever it is that you do. Do you know anyone who would benefit from working with me? And make it really easy for them to say yes. Tell them what to say. Write a referral email for them based on things that they've already said about you. Yes, that might seem really weird that you're writing the referral email, but people love to be of service. They love to help you, but people are busy and they often get stumped and they don't know what to say. So help them, give them a place to start. But I encourage you over the next week to go out and ask three different people for referrals. You could do this with a phone call. You could do it through an email, or you could invite a strategic partner to go have coffee, tell them what's up, ask them how you can be of service to them, and ask if they would be willing to refer you to three people that would benefit from working for you. Use your profit planner to plan out this process. Go every single day and take one action that's gonna move you closer to asking for those referrals. It's a really fun way to do business is to get referrals. And so many people, I hear them say this over and over again, it's actually one of my pet peeves. Well, I only work by word of mouth. Well, word of mouth is passive marketing. You have no control 
over when people are going to send you referrals. So be proactive and ask, just ask, ask for referrals. That's your challenge for this week. Another great strategy for getting a bunch of new clients in the next 30 days would be to host an event or a workshop. Oh, that might seem really scary and intimidating for you, but what if you invited five friends over and you gave an informal workshop in your living room? I've done it around my kitchen table. One night we cleared out our kitchen and we actually got 20 chairs into our kitchen space, theater style, and I did a two hour workshop for people in my kitchen. And from that got five new clients. So host a workshop, host an event, ask a friend to host you. There's a reason that Tupperware and Mary Kay and other companies like that have been so um, tremendously successful over the years is the home party model works. How could it work for you? So I invite you to think outside the box. Who could you ask to support you? Who could you invite over? And just get in front of some people and share what it is that you're passionate about and make a simple offer for a free consult to have them take a step further to get to know you and how you can help them solve their problems. And then the last strategy that I wanna share with you is actually a two-part strategy as well. And it's just to offer free consultations. Almost every business can benefit from offering free consultations of some kind, but especially if you're a coach, if you're a speaker, a trainer, or a designer, either a graphic designer or an interior designer, you can benefit from offering free consultations to people. So you can do this in a couple of different ways, actually three different ways. So one would be if you have an email list and you're using email marketing to email your list and say, hey, I've got a couple of spots open. Who needs some help with X, whatever the problem is that you solve for them? So in my case, I might send an email out to our list and say, hey, I've got some time in my calendar this week. I'm offering a free few time management breakthrough sessions for people. If you're really struggling with time management in your business, please take advantage of one of these free 30 minute consultations. I only have space for about three of those and first come first served, right? That's one way to do it. Use Facebook. Are your clients on Facebook? Just get on Facebook and say, hey, I've got some time this week. I wanna do a little market research. I wanna connect with some people. Just ask on Facebook who would like a free consult. Invite them to send you a private message and get it booked and get it happening now. And then finally, use that exact same process on LinkedIn as well. You could do it as a post on LinkedIn, you could do it as an update on LinkedIn, or you could directly message several people that maybe you've been thinking about or wanting to connect with and just say, hey, I've been thinking about you, I'd love to have a conversation. So if you're getting the drift of what it is that I'm saying about how to get three new clients in the next 30 days, the secret is to get out of your house and go talk to some people. Get in front of more people. The more people that you can reach, the more likely you are to get three, six, nine, 12, even 20 new clients in the next 30 days. Be intentional about it. And for some of you who this may seem a little intimidating or you're a little introverted, find safe ways to do this invite friends over, people that you know care about you, and just practice doing it. So get out there, have some fun, get those new clients, and make sure you come on back and share your successes in the Facebook group. We'd love to hear from you. This is the final series, final video in our series, and I want to remind you that we would love to have you come as our guest to the Path to Profit Design Your Roadmap to Success Summit. You've got access to two free tickets in your Artful Profit Planner, so please come and play with us. We're gonna make this even more clear than we hopefully already have for you. We're gonna make it more fun to grow your business and we're gonna make sure that you get on the path to profit and you stay there. So get off that money roller coaster, get serious about your business, get playful about your business and let's make some money. See you later, I'm Dr. Minette Riordan, CEO and founder of the Path to Profit Academy.